Did you know that 61% of York County is covered with trees? I'm Greg Suskin, Public Information Officer for York County. Even though there's been tremendous growth here, the county has a goal to increase its tree canopy. How? By using this. More on that in just a moment, but here's your County Council update from Monday night. Council held a public hearing on proposed changes to separation requirements for some Lake Wiley businesses. Approved a contract with Midwest Maintenance for $1.8 million for structural repair at the McKelvey Center in York. Approved a design build contract with J.D. Goodrum Company for $376,000 for the Greenway Project at Catawba Bend Preserve. And heard an update from the Lake Wiley Marine Commission on proposed safety regulations for charter and rental boats. As we said a minute ago, York County's tree canopy covers 61% of the county. The challenge is to encourage development, but protect what's here at the same time. There is a balancing act. Says Peter Kosicki, York County's landscape architect. When there's a new development underway, he's often involved, like here at the upcoming Clove Village on Highway 274 in Lake Wiley. We don't want to restrict a developer from coming in and building by rights, um, but at the same time, we do want to preserve some of the site's natural character. On this site, Kosicki worked with developers to save several grand trees. So what's a grand tree? It comes down to the species and how wide it measures around the trunk at chest height. The chart looks like this. All these trees that measure at least these sizes around their trunks are grand trees according to county ordinance. This doesn't mean grand trees can't be cut down, but when they are, you need a permit and... We really advocate for um, either trees to be replanted or additional tree canopy area to be preserved on the site. Often a developer may have to plant 15 new trees for every grand tree removed. While the loss of a stately old tree is unfortunate, that's how Kosicki says our tree canopy can actually grow. Those 15 new trees are going to be much smaller when they're first put in, but in 30 years, those 15 trees will contain much more canopy than the one tree that we have. York County planners do work with developers to try and save grand trees whenever possible. The shade, the beauty, the free oxygen, not easy to replace. And they can really um, give us a, a site a sense of place when you have these, these older stately trees on them. Um, they, it really transforms the site and, and how it looks and how it appears. To learn more about our grand tree ordinance, go to our website at yourcountygov.com. Click on council, agendas, Find the media packet for the February 5th meeting, then scroll down to page 63. Thanks for joining us for York County Now. We know once those fingers get rolling, it's hard to stop scrolling. So thanks for stopping on us. We'll see you next time.